Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for May 23rd, 2021. So, let's see, I just got chills. Like excited chills. Ooh, it's an adventure today. <laughs> the, this was taken out of the deck. The energy is gaining momentum. I had chills, like an energy going through me. And it says the energy is gaining momentum. Well, okay. This is waxing moon. So... There's no simplistic way to explain the process that we're going through. We do the best that we can, right? But when we say that energy is gaining momentum, there's this feeling of having, um, you know, going through all the stuff we've already talked about, like the healing, the releasing, the understanding, the connecting into the heart space and what is the heart intelligence telling us? Where are we getting too top heavy, right? Getting too logistical and trying to analyze everything and have it all, you know, fit into a narrative you know the whole thing when we allow that stuff to flow away and we're in our natural state if I can put it that way we're in our homeostasis we're just kind of like right here now we start going in a different direction and I think that's what this card is talking about you're on your way uh, on maybe to a new path it may not look that different on the outside but how you approach it is different. If you've ever heard um, somebody say, oh, I'm never going back to that place. And someone else may say, well, you're a very different person now than you were back then. So even if you go to that place that you never thought you would go to again, you're going to see it differently. You're going to handle it differently. And maybe you've gained a lot of strength. Right? And so the things that once would have made you feel so wounded, you, you find humor in it. Y'all ridiculous. Like, <laughs> right? you know, something like that. So the energy is gaining momentum. It's a, it's a breaking open. It's an understanding. You're, you're going down this, yeah, I guess fine, new path. <laughs> Why do I have such a bad a attitude about it? Because it's become cliche. It's not just going down a new path. It's showing up differently on that path right? And it is going, okay, that doesn't work anymore. I, in my energy, will disconnect from it. And let's see what adventure awaits us now. Again, I had the chills go up my body <laughs> when I started to shuffle. Something is coming at you. This could be, yes, an adventure. Yes, this could be love. Oh, love is on for everybody. It's on deck here, you know? Like, so don't be afraid to tap into that, but do it in a healthy way. Don't do this thing where, especially if you're single and you're getting desperate and you're, you're like, I really hate being alone because I think it means something about me if I'm alone. And then what? You end up with somebody who diminishes you. God forbid if you end up with somebody who abuses you. The examples that have gone off in Colorado Springs recently, those can't be ignored. That can't be ignored. That is the very type of thing. They, you know, this angelic presence, these angels have been coming in and saying, turn away from that sort of thing. I'm not saying that in that situation, anybody was desperate. I don't know that situation, but it, 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 it's sort of um, a very recent example of how some people will get into dynamics and maybe they don't know what they're getting into. How can we ever really know? You know what I'm saying? Like, unless you're tuned into your intuition. And even then, you know, your intuition could be spot on most times. But if you do get into a space of, I just want a partner. Well, th I can feel the pain in this person. And I'm in pain. So let's come together and we can heal one another. Oh, it's going to be tumultuous. Oh, you know, he, she just says that. And men get abused too. Don't you put up with it either. Okay? No. Oh, he, she is, is like that. We're in the process of healing. That's why it's erupting all the time. Love is not a master. Love doesn't own. Love doesn't control. Love doesn't hurt the way you think. Okay? It's not ever okay for someone to cross your boundaries, to violate you, to harm you. Now, emotionally, if you have to go through a breakup, yeah, that's where we say love hurts. But I'm talking in a, 
that other way. So there is a, a big message here, again, to cut away these old patterns and let's stop I'm, I'm getting these, let's stop sacrificing souls because we're not getting it. Pay attention. Let the understanding land so that we can start putting this different energy out there and we don't need to learn our lessons in such a hard way. Okay, we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.